I love living. I love living and I enjoy doing things. I'm never still. Hitting the ice for the season's first practice. It's an exciting day for Lola Holmes. But there's something extra special this time around. We're here at the Vancouver Curling Club for a very special celebration. Lola Holmes here. Tell us, what are we celebrating? My Guinness World Book of Records. And I'm so excited and I hardly know what to do. <laughs> That's right. The Vancouver woman just turned 100 years old. And her milestone birthday has granted her a nomination in the Guinness World Records as the world's oldest active curler. I never thought that I would ever, when I got to be 108 days old, that I would poss could possibly be curly. She's such an inspiration, and we all wish that we could keep going and be so positive and delightful. Lola is so accurate that I'd rather have her on my team than against me, for sure. The grandmother of four hasn't always curled. She began at the age of 80, and her first time wasn't very promising. Needless to say, I couldn't stand up. He looked at me and he said, I don't think you're going to make it, lady. But she proved everyone wrong. 20 years later, still curling strong. It's exercise, it's skill, it's uh, friendship. While the world has changed a lot since she was born in 1918. These girls used to run to the window of the school to see an airplane go over. There's one thing that she has always done, no matter her age. Just as active as the word, don't be a couch potato for sure, please. While she hopes her record will encourage people to give curling a try, most of all, she hopes to show people it's never too late to pursue new goals. Everybody aim for it. Now that you know can be done, aim for it, please. In Vancouver, Isabel Regem, City News.